The goal for archery is to hit the ten ring. There are so many variables working against you, and the one that you can't see is when. Picking up here in the booth. We can see Vemma wobbling around. He's holding on to this one. Five seconds left. And he's pulled that one off the target completely. If you ever want to know exactly how it feels to be out in the wind and feel like you're outclassed by it, uh, just watch my bronze medal match from Salt Lake City and you'll see someone who has lost their zero, has no, no idea where to aim, and just is struggling. There's three main things that I look at when I'm trying to figure out where to aim. There is the flag on top of the target, there is the, you know, the big soccer flag in the middle of the field, and then there is what I feel on myself. The drift is going to be manipulated by the flag that's on the target, and then I'm using the wind that's on me to try to pick lulls and, and calmer times or more consistent times to shoot. So there are three methods that archers use to compensate for the wind. Aiming off is the first one. If you have a really consistent wind and you want to aim in the 8 ring or aim in the left 9-8 line, you can do that. What that means is put your sight pin the opposite of where you think the arrow is going to land. Second, you can cant your bow. So what that means is you're going to angle your, your top limb into the wind to try to counteract it. You have a little bit of a reference on your bubble, so you can do like a half bubble, three quarter bubble, full bubble, left or right, in order to kind of move the arrow. Third is a combination of both. You can click your sight. Um, so you're just gonna aim in the middle and you're gonna look and say like, okay, the arrow's gonna hit right, you know, halfway through the nine ring. So you give it like six or seven clicks and then aim on in the middle. So wind throws a lot of monkey wrenches into your shot and it, and it breaks it down. It's really hard to commit to, to making a good shot. The most important thing is maintaining your, your perfect shot even in less than ideal conditions.